Madam Beatrice, you've not gone? No. Primary six pupils are preparing for their more common entrance. Mm -hmm. So I'm helping to coach them with their current affairs. Okay. I hope they all pass soon. I hope so too. Madam Beatrice, are you waiting for somebody? Jonathan, mind your business, you hear me? Why are you querying me as if I'm your wife or your daughter? Ah. I'm sorry. It's only that I'm concerned because you look unhappy. Well, don't worry, I'm fine. Bye bye. I'll see you tomorrow. You won't see me tomorrow. Why? Are you traveling? It's Saturday. It's the same person. Is she still around? Okay, she has gone. Mm -hmm. uh, she was sitting on that seat, on this particular one now. Yes. But she left about uh, 10 or 7 minutes ago. But where, which way did she take? Mm -hmm. She went that way. For you, I thought you were not going to come. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You see, it is the man whom I was moving his house who delayed me. He didn't pay me my balance in time. But you know, when he paid me that balance, I ran straight to Ketiko's bar to get something for you. Here it is. Take it. What is it? Orange. Banana, guava, pineapple, melon, and all the cherry fruits in this world mixed together by the science people of Nigeria. So that when you drink it, you see your body, <laughs> it will be jolly, jolly, and fine. Eh? Adia? Uh, okay. uh, can I carry you on my bicycle? Or do we uh, check together, uh, talking and laughing? Let's drink. English night trek and they call it taking a walk. Okay, taking a walk. So let us take a walk and I hold your hand like this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I could do what, what does English people do? They do like this. See, mm -hmm. eh? okay, good. Let's go. <laughs> and I hold my bicycle with this hand like this. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. And then we we'll start. Let's go, yeah, my dear. You see. Uh, my wife. Uh, my wife has been giving me a lot of trouble. My wife and that her useless son and her equally useless four daughters. But that woman, her end has come in my house. Yes, you see, I need, I need a, a woman like you in my life. Yes. Let's go. It's not to be. From the first time you entered this village, they have been looking at you. A woman like this with plenty of book in her head. How am I going to manage to tell her that I love her? It's a long, long time. From the first time you came into this village, I was watching. I said, This woman, 
What am I going to do so that she can love me? I, am, I was tired of that woman a long time ago. Just not now. But hey. you so I was wondering, my dear. My finger. <laughs> I look at your back. I look at oh. <laughs> you see, I, I never knew that a girl like you who will love a man like me. So I, I was thinking, I was thinking, I said, I will tell you, mm, I, I'm a courageous man. If when we were people used to fight war in this place, I was I was a warrior. I used some of courage to tell you that a woman I love you. I see you. I say, no, you love me too. Yati, yati, yati. I hope the children, I hope the children don't come here. Before you know it, they will see me, their teacher, setting a bad example. No, not, no, 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 no. That is not possible. You see? Who will give them the money to come here? Eh? This place is a very expensive place. Eh? A plate of Nkobi is 150. Mm -hmm. Yes, a plate of issue is 300 naira, and then a tumbler like this of who send you come of pan wine <laughs> is 70 naira. Who will give those small small boys that kind of money? Ah. You don't know these boys, you don't know these children, they will steal their parents' money, and before you know it, they land in a place like this to, to enjoy with their friends. You don't know. Why are you so quiet? You remind me of that foolish boy who calls himself my son, Obumselo. All that boy does is drink and wine, play card, and go around with small, 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 small girls in the village. You know? Giving me his father heartache. Eh? I wish you would come in, in time, and give me an intelligent son. A son who has common sense that is not common in my house today. Am I that intelligent? Ah! <laughs> who will say that you're not intelligent? But dear, yeah, is Chike will be more intelligent than you are? You teach religion, current affairs, English language, social studies. <laughs> Nadia, when it comes to book, you are fire, mm. not uh, uh, Nora. Nora, that woman with dry coconut brain like all her children, her four daughters and her boy. Especially that boy of Bumselu. Mm. Anyway, Nora is leaving my house any time from now. And then you come in. <laughs> when you come in, then you give me a real son. You understand? Not an evil level. No. You see, this is the mistake that I have made. After 30 years of marriage marry to Nora, I have realized that it was a mistake. You understand what I'm saying? And I am going to correct that mistake, my dear. If it is possible this evening, you must pack him to come and stay with me. Let Nora go. But Nora, oh. but it must it be it must it be by force. I beg, let me eat. I when a woman is not good enough for a man, you will see it. I'm intelligent. Like you. You understand? But Nora could not dry brain. 
you know? I get it. Uh, call that woman. Bring the more uh, the fried chicken. The, the the leg. That leg you put paper well well. Bring it. Okay, are you doing like this? Wow. Hear what my eyes are seeing. Uh, what are your eyes seeing? <laughs> what is it? Hey, tell me now. My eyes have seen my ears. <laughs> I am a fugon hey. Hey. Tell me what it is. I do not come to gossip. Uh -huh. But I saw your husband, Matthew, <laughs> walking down the road with the axe. It's again. Hey! hey. Exactly where they're going to. I saw them along Ukwebu Road, opposite the mission, heading to Beatty's house. What? <laughs> Mazi Okoro was so shameless in the way he held her hand, squeezing it into his hands. I know abomination. I know abomination. Pick up that food. Take off that suit. Abomination. I'm going somewhere. Mama, is there any problem? Your father. Your father has come here again. He has never seen Beatty again. I'm in I am coming. Abomination. No. See the way you are squeezing her. Beatty! 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 You must show me why you buried it, though. Beatty, you must show me why you buried it. You must show me that time that you used to tell my husband. You will show me why you buried it so I can take it out. You will on it. Daddy, come out and show me this camera. Oh, Kara, I know you're inside there. Come out. Come out here, Kara, because I'm not going anywhere. Mama, you mean, what? That is not your back from school now. What do you mean she's not your back from school? Eh? What is it about not there? It's not. Oh. Oh. Oh, where is she? They told me that she was heading here with my husband. Oh, Kara. But this morning she left, I've not seen her. Hi. Hey. Come on. Hello. Hello, That is. They have got to a hotel. Get your money at the no hotel. Get your money at the hotel. Hey, maybe they enter through the window. Hey, hey. Open this window. Open. Open. I know you people are there. Open the window. Okay. If you're not there. I will sit down here and wait. I will wait for you people until you come back. I cannot give up on Koro. Mumba, I see God. Hi, Hey, Hi, hello, Hi, hi. Umu ise, umu ise kamu lo kara umu ise. Yati ala putamo. Yati, yati, yati. Well, this is where we part. No. <laughs> you go this way. I go this way. Hmm? How I wish you were coming home with me today. Don't worry. Very soon. Very soon. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> I will not wash my face today. You understand? Yes, I'm going to keep on touching my face today so I can feel the wetness of your soft lips. <laughs> hey,
must come back. Agaracha must come back. Agaracha must come. I'm here. I'm here for us to fight, Beati. Excuse me? What do you want? What do I want? You want to know what I want? Okay. I will tell you. I want three things. First, Beati, take a good look at yourself. Then take a look at me. Chalukwa, let me turn around so you can see me very well. Nekuya, Beati, Nekuya. Huh? Now tell me, you and I, who is the most beautiful? Now, remember, oh, childbirth has not made your body to relax and made it potter potter. Or me, eh, who has had five beautiful children, hmm? and pregnancy has made my body supple and rich in the oil of womanhood. Go, two. I want you to show me where you buried that child that you used to hold my husband, Okoro. Then number three. Give me, give me, give me. I know he bought it for you. My husband bought it for you. You are a thief, Beati. Thief. If that will make you happy, you can have it. Ah, yes. Have it. Oh, you think this is all? This cannot make me happy. Eh? I have come here today to fight you, Beati. I have come to fight you. Biati, it is fight or go. I'm on a line. So I'm on a line. You be Biati, do something. Biati, I will shoot you today. Biati, 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 I will show you today. Today is fight, Biati. Biati, do something. Do something, Biati. Biati, I have come to fight you. Biati, okay. Biati, okay. Biati. Beati! Beati, you will not fight, eh? You will not fight. How can you fight? You don't, you're not even woman enough to fight a fellow woman. Eh? Oh, I have even forgotten. After all the time you spent with my husband in the hotel, you don't have any strength. Eh, okay, give me, give me. Give me. Beati, fight me! Listen, you want shoes? I have them in my room. Many, many of them. Many that I don't even and you can have them if that's what makes you happy. Okay. You can have the shoes. Hi. Yes, I have come here to find you. Now you have to find me. When you are not there, we were. How you are? It's my husband, Oko, that I have a problem with. I'm going to do with Oko. Me, me, no Oko, help me. Oko, no. Oko, no, we go for. Enjoy this drink. Uh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Mama. Uh -huh. Let us enjoy now. Hey, would you? Don't you not say thank you? Brother, I don't ever thank anybody when they give you something. I don't have to talk to you if you're not talking to me. Yeah, my older brothers are learning from me. Hey! 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 Am I a stranger in this house? Huh? Am I a stranger in this house? Am I a stranger? Why didn't you ask for your own drink? Mama, tell her to sit down. After all, I'm the senior brother. Eh? I'm not a man. What is wrong with you? Look, look at this small thing. Look, look at, look at. Small thing like this. One, two, before her. Before her. Okay. Hi. Oh, no, 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 I'll ask my own man, give me. God, save me from a hand. Mama, 
What's my own difference in this house? Every of my sister is taking English by wine and nobody called God. Now it is my turn. Give me English by wine and you're calling God. You're inviting God to this matter. Hey, mama. Okay. If you're not my mother, tell me. If you're not my mother, tell me so I can simply go out and look for my mother. I don't understand though. I don't understand. What's all this noise about? Ah. Eh, so ah. you want some more? Wait. Very sweet. This thing to you people that you are drinking. <laughs> Hey, Room that you didn't even wait for one minute. Huh? My oh dear, I brought dry meat and uh, juice for you. Your wife attacked me yesterday. Nora! She attacked me. She pulled off my wig, snatched my bag, took off my shoes, pushed me around her fingers into my face. She called me a charmer that I charmed you. And to top it all, she snatched a bag of juice you got for me. There was nothing she didn't do to push me into a fight. But I held myself. No wonder. No wonder. That must be the drink I saw with her. Sharing with her daughters and that useless son of ours yesterday. My dear, I'm sorry about it. I'm very, very sorry about it. I can't take any more of this. If you're going to drive her away too quickly, do you hear me? Because I'm too old for this concubine, girlfriend, boyfriend thing. I'm too old for it. 
In fact, Nora is a very lucky woman. She is, should thank her stars that she met me in a good mood yesterday after seeing you because I love you so much. If not, I would have taught her a lesson of her life. Nora, listen, my dear, please. I promise you from this moment, with all the love that I have for you in my heart, yes, from the day I saw you come into that village school, you understand? I've loved you. And I promise you this moment that Nora will not spend more than one week in my house from now on. She has to go. She has to go. She will not be my wife anymore. My dear, please just relax. Take dried meat I brought for you and a drink, my dear. Take, come on, come on. Accept it, my dear. Come on. Come on, my love. No, 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 it's all for you. Let's take some of this. Deserve a good wife, one that will bear you good children, particularly a sensible son. Nobody can stop me, Yati, Yati, oh! I must go marry Yati, 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 oh! No stupid that can stop me, Yati. Oh, give me my bag, 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 I'm fed up. It is not your house. It is our house. Hey, yes. Our house. <laughs> you are living. Listen. You and your useless son and your girls, girls, girls upon girls. Yes. You take them out of my house. Today. What have I done to deserve this kind of treatment from you, Okoro? Hey, God. Oh, Yeah. Oh, no, stop now. What is this to me? I've had enough of you. Anymore. Eh, after giving him beautiful children, four lovely girls and a son, at this our middle age, God, I can't believe it. Ever since Beatty came into the start, Look. he has suddenly found me useless. Look, I don't want you to mention Beatty's name again in this matter. Leave Beatty out of this matter. You gave me a son, you gave me a son, you gave me a son. Is this the one you call a son? This thing. Do you call this one a son? Huh? I don't feel like this. It's what you call a son. Huh? I hear you. A son. Listen, I want a real son. You understand? A real son, not, not a useless thing like this. Uh, so I'm not a real son. I am not a real son. The people will hear it. I'm not a real son. Okay. If I am not a real son, are you a real father? Are you a real father? Answer me. Answer me. Listen. Tell your son to shut his palm, my mouth. Out immediately, or else I'll shut it for him. Yes. Nonsense. Look, it has ended. Just pack your things. Go. Am I not going anywhere for that father? I'm not going anywhere. Girls, post them. In my house. Man, there's no person. Oh my God! Oh God! Oh my 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 God!
asking hey, you. Jesus. Ask your God. Go up there, ask him. Say, Father, why? Why did you put only women and a useless man in my womb? It's not me I'm going to ask him. Go up and ask him. Oh, Lord, it's not me. Oh, Lord. Don't press me. Don't press me. Don't press me. Will not let me that be sent to this house. You see, no, we are big girls now. We will not allow it at all. <laughs> 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 hey, Obunse, Obunse, a real man calls the father to mother when he dreams of the Go and talk to Papa. Go. Look at you. Look at you. Look at yourself. Don't hear yourself. A real man calls his father to mother when he dreams of the When he called me. And that I'm not a resort. When he said that I'm not a resort, did you call him to order? Did you call him to order? Now you want somebody who is not a real man to be a resort. How can it be? When I'm not a real man, how can I be a resort? Look at you. You're not ashamed of yourself. Abum said, You should be ashamed of yourself. You should be ashamed of yourself. And you should not be ashamed of yourself. Hey, 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 see, see, see. I wish I had the most senior sister instead of a senior brother like you. Fool, look at you. If I were girl, Papa would have sent you all out of this house. Eh? Thank your God, though. Just thank your God that I'm a man and save you people. Look at, look at you. 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 Look you. Look at you. are such a disgrace in this house. And you can't even change. Shia. 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 come to do is unheard of. Had it been that my father, Carl, who gave my sister's son to you in marriage, was alive, he could have chased you out of this compound. <laughs> this reminds me of my father's death. Oh. Carlo is no more. Oh. And look at me, what can I do? Oh. I am only Nora's brother. Not her father. But since you have decided not to marry my sister again, oh, I gladly take her back. Let's hmm. be my brother, you have said it all. And let me sound a note of warning to Okoro, our former in law, and his kinsmen who accompanied him to our house. Let nobody demand for the money paid on. Uh, Nora's head since 30 years ago after all she has had five children for you in fact you are supposed to pay us some amount of money for bringing her back am I not saying the truth Mazud let us maintain peace with our in-laws our former in-laws put it that way yes our former in-law <laughs> Nora is inside the house, crying out her poor life. But what can we say? What can we say? We are happy that you brought back our daughter and our sister to us in one piece. So, chatter the calabash and go. Our God will surely judge. Correct. <clears throat> Yes. But you say that when the masquerade dances badly, its owners will scratch their heads. Are you prepared to go ahead with the divorce? Look, let us scratch your eyelids because I am very prepared to go through this divorce. Mm -hmm. If I'm dancing badly, no problem. I'm going through this divorce. So scratch your eyelids. Very well done. I'm ready. I'm prepared. Well done. Ezobi, call Nora for us, please. 
let her come with the symbol of the calabash of palm wine with which her introduction right was made some 30 years ago. Please. Bam. Mm. Oh, yeah. sign of shutting of the calabash to show that you are no longer interested in marrying Nora, your wife. Yes, I will shatter it. I am going to shatter it. Watch me. Have 
you all seen her? Can you see her? Are you seeing her very well? Yes. Uh, I can see her. I'm seeing her. <laughs> Sit down, my dear. Yes. Yes. Her name is Beatrice. Beatty for short. Hmm? She is my new wife. Okay? <laughs> and for you, Yes, you have a new mother in the house, and her name is still Beatrice. You will obey her, you will respect her, and you will honor her. Are you hearing me? Very soon, I am going to carry one. For her introduction. Eh? Are you hearing me? Now, my children, rise on your feet and say to her, Welcome, our new mother. Since Papa wants to force that woman on us, we will fight against her. Exactly. That woman will never have rest in this house. She must leave this house, whether she likes it or not. Continue now. Continue talking. People have stopped talking. Eh? Okay. Let's sit down and watch. Look at ourselves. Obomsel. We would have asked you out of this place. Because you're a strange one. But since you're our brother, we cannot have this discussion without you. Now, we all have agreed that that woman must leave this house, whether she likes it or not. Straight, what are we waiting for? Let's go there now and push her out. Eh? Let us go and throw her out. Let us go. No, and no, push no, no, her no, 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 no. Ah. See, eh? We have decided to use every method in this world and within our own reach to make sure that that woman carries her bag and leaves this house. Within next month. Then Mama will come back to the south. That is it now. Proper planning. Whatever you need in this world, once you plan it very well, no problem. Look, let me tell you that I'm still in this village today because I plan my life very well. <laughs> I'm a planner, master planner. <laughs> and whatever we do, I mean, whatever we do, we must all stand together. Straight. Straight. Mm. Uh -huh. 
But nobody should drink palm wine and forget himself. Oh, Look at, look at this small thing. This parrot, you are talking to me like this, Abby. Eh? You are talking to me like this. You don't have respect again. Let me tell you, this is time for action. Not time for drinking palm It is time for action. Oh, but it's okay. Just sit down. Now, everybody, no matter what we do to her, nobody must tell. Nobody must tell. We must be united. We are four blood sisters and one blood brother. We must all have one heart. Agreed. Agreed. Agreed, agreed, no problem, agreed. Obum Selo, agreed. Agreed, agreed. <laughs> Let us go and plan very well, I'm coming. Eh? Agreed, no problem. Obum, come back, come back in. Come. Just sit down. Come here. Point number one. Nobody must obey that woman. Nobody. There should be no respect, especially from you. You know your mouth is very sharp. Use it on her. Secondly, even Papa, nobody should wash his clothes again. Obum, I am telling you. Ah, uh -uh, don't do me again. Uh -uh. Thirdly, even the morning chores, nobody will do it. We will sleep and sleep till 12 o'clock. I won't sleep till 4. Nobody should wake up to do anything. We must turn this house upside down and see that our mother comes back to this house. Agreed. 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 Yes. Agreed. If it is fight, we fight. Fight straight. Action. Irima, uh, is your father in? No. Eh. Hey. All right. Is there any message? Yes. Keep this drink for him. Okay. Eh? okay. Tell him it is part of the wine for uh, introducing his new wife to the elders this evening. Yes. Eh? Good. Let him know that I will see him later in the evening. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I saw Papa. I saw Papa going from one elder's house to the other, inviting them to come for the introduction of his new wife. I am sure he's not going to come back on time because Auntie Beatrice is still at school. Are you sure? Very sure. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> Very sure. Good work. <laughs> Good work, Abum. <laughs> now, go and stand in front of the door. Okay. Fast.
Sit and wash your clothes. Almost outside our compound. Eh? Uh, no, Papa. But Uju was playing with me and putting her hands inside this, the water. That was why I came this far to to finish up the washing. Okay. Well, I asked uh, Maziago to bring some palm wine for me. Has he brought them? Um. Yes, he has brought it, but I don't know exactly where. Let me ask. Uh, no, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Mm. Let me go. I want to go to school and pick up uh, my darling, Betty. You know, she must be closing by now. And you know, I'm very hungry. I'm beginning to like her cooking seriously. <laughs> yeah, laughing here. <laughs> yeah, he, <laughs> you are beginning to like Beatty too, eh? Yes, Papa. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, let me go then. It's good. That is what I tell my children. You must like people. You cannot just start disliking somebody because of your mother. Mm -hmm. Yes, Papa. Papa, go well, eh? <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. I've seen her new wife. Yes. <laughs> she looks beautiful, doesn't she? Yes. More than beautiful. Oh. <laughs> We've also seen the wine, the pound wine our brother brought for us to drink together to invite the blessings of the gods upon his new wife. The most striking thing about this palm wine is its red color.
enjoying the presence of our cherished red substance, Nche, which clears <laughs> men's heads. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um, you have done well. We salute you. Beati, our new wife, we salute you. You are welcome. No. 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 And as we drink, may we drink peace. He said. May we drink progress. He said. May we drink long life and prosperity. He said. May our young women find good husbands in good time. He said. May our young men. Be sensible and hardworking. He said. And may the gods of our land bless us all abundantly. He said. I will tell you. <laughs> Shall we drink?
Keep your mouth shut. I will keep my mouth shut, but my body is doing so much work. You know, I've not told lies before. Just say anything. Say anything and I'll do with you in this house. Don't talk off. Talk off all of us. Okay, I, I, I will not talk. I, I swear, I will not talk. I suspect that a bomb cello, you know, he was behaving strange when I was talking to all of them. Hmm. Yes. That boy is a strange one. He is. All he loves food, <laughs> alcohol, cards, and then little, little village girls. You know. Well, I know just the kind of food he loves. And I know how to get the truth out of him. Yes, my dear, because we have to get to the bottom of this. Yes. We have to. Very cheerful today. <laughs> if it is cheerful, I have it a lot. 
Well done, oh. Hey, thank you. Yeah. Well done. Oh, thank you. Bravo. <laughs> 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 Why don't you go and get a plate? Let me give you some chicken. Eh, yeah? uh, go, 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 go and get a plate. Okay. <laughs> Come, I want to tell you something. Tell me what you want to tell me. Come, stop me. Abon, Abon, come. The surprising thing is that you people don't even have any respect for your brother. Look at the way you're summoning him. Abon, come, come, come. As if he's your younger one. You don't mind them, Mom. Don't mind them. Hmm. One of these days, eh? Look at this small, small rat. One of these days, I'll give you very hot slap. Last night. Look at Auntie, don't look at me. Don't worry. Auntie, you're a very good woman. Let me tell you. When my mother was here, she never gave me chicken to talk. Let alone petting me like you are doing. Look at you now, carrying my water. <laughs> Album. Auntie. You know I like you. In fact, I wish you were my own son. Auntie. We call you bad name for nothing. Don't mind them, they are jealous. As far as I'm concerned, Obum is on your side. And God is on our side. Amen. Obum. Amen. Auntie. My heart is troubled and heavy. Good problem. Auntie, what is the matter? Do you know who put Pepe? in the palm wine, meant for the elders. Yes, auntie, it is. It is who? Uh, auntie, I don't know again. I thought I knew before. I don't know. Mm. I don't know. You want some water? Mm. Mm. How about some more chicken? Chicken. Are you sure I'm not going to tell anybody? Oh, boom. Tell me. Okay. Hey, you on Judeca. You are the master planner. The evil mind that dreams of all manners of evil against my wife and I. Yes. The elders must know you. You must meet them. To tell them your role in this family. Yes. And you? You. You, the fool brothers. You are the one who put Pepe in the family meant for elders. Right? Shut up and come with me. Let's go. Will you get out of my way? Will you get out of my way? You are planning against your family. You will see. Come. Come on, everybody. This is the girl. Go to Pepe in the family. Just ask the girl. Why are you people looking at me like this now? Eh? You are looking at me as if I was the one that told you, Father. See, the Papa told me that I was the one that told him. Eh? Eh? I, I will get this from anybody. I don't want you to. I don't want you to. Eh? Hey! Now, nah, come on. Check out. Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Who's this?
Collaboration of our sisters. That's what you said. But, um, Mr. Passan, you must be very careful how you handle matters in your house. You must make sure that your children, especially your daughters, like your new wife, Beati, and that they live peacefully together. Else, you will have more problems in your house. As you could, I have tried. I have tried. I have tried. But you see, those girls. My daughters, they will not, they do not want to live in peace and harmony with my darling Betty. And I love that woman. You, you know, I, do you know something? She lost me in return. If you were in their shoes, would you like her? Would you? A woman who has taken your mother's place. Would you like her? Listen. Sending your wife of 30 years standing away from your house for a mere excuse that she has only female children and a boy who happens to be foolish is not enough reason. A bumsellow's lifestyle is not Nora's uh, fault. It is not. But uh, what could I have done? What could I have done? Eh? A, a foolish son. A cretin. Uh, to carry on with my bloodline. No, nah, it's not possible. I will not let it be. In, not in this lifetime. Okay. Please. Okay. Let, let, me ask, let, let me ask you a question. How are you sure that Beati is even going to give you babies? How? What are you saying, Naziago? What are you saying? What kind of talk is this? Are you saying that I am not capable of fathering a child again? Or are you saying that Beth is too old? I'm not saying anything like that. What, what, what are you talking about? I haven't said what anything are you like saying? that. I haven't said anything like that. I'm only asking you questions. How are, are you sure that Beatty is going to give you a baby boy? And a sensible one for that matter? How are you sure? What are you talking about? Are you saying that there's only foolish people that can come from my bloodline? Or what What kind of talk is this? Look, is this look, why I came to your house look, to come and listen to you? All I'm saying is that you should have spent time teaching your boomsel, coaching him, guiding him, correcting him, changing him. That's all there is to be done. Rather than give him up as, uh, for, for lost and then up to marry a new wife. That you tell your family about. Ah, wait a minute. Yeah, Honestly, were you not the one who escorted me to go and break Nora's calabash? Eh, wait, 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 wait. You wait, wait, wait. You, no, wait, you wait, you wait, you wait, you wait, you wait, wait. The pan wine that we took there, who gave it to me? Was it not you? I said, huh? I said, wait. I only followed you. Because it is my duty to you as my king's man. That's all. Yeah. It is your duty as my king's man. Yes. To follow me there. Mm -hmm. But it is not your duty as my king's man to tell me within our own compound that this thing that you are doing now is not good. So that at least I can consider it and change. Now you are coming to take the sides of my enemies. Yeah. If I had advised you, would you have accepted it? Yes. Nobody, you couldn't, because everybody knows you that you don't accept advice. You couldn't have accepted it. I don't know, accept everybody, everybody it. knows that you couldn't. Let me, let me let you know. I think I'm beginning to suspect that you got the paper to put in, in the pan wine so that you can destroy me. Mm, in this place. I am not against you. But what I want you to understand is that I will speak with the elders. Hmm? And tell them 
is mere domestic misunderstanding. Whatever decision they take, I'll let you know. That is all. If you like, tell them. If you like, don't tell them. But I tell you, you are part and parcel of this thing. You probably are the one who gave the paper to those children. Me. If you like, tell them. Me. If you don't like, what, do whatever you do. For the sake of peace, one heart, one mind, done togetherness in this family, I've asked my new darling wife to prepare this meal. This is a meal of peace. We'll eat and drink together as one family and put all our disagreements behind us. My dear, share the food, beginning with daddy. <laughs> are here and before we reveal our secrets do you have anything to tell us elders and fathers of our land I want to beg for forgiveness on behalf of myself and my younger sisters little miss now you know that you are protected the elders we were only fighting against our father's decision to send our mother away and marry a new wife who has been harsh and wicked to us. We didn't mean to poison the elders. We only wanted to disturb the, the introduction meeting. You see? You see, you see, you see what they plan against me. Sorry. It will be my man. Yeah. My man. Yeah. We have heard the explanation from Okoro's daughters. It is all a domestic problem, a misunderstanding. But in doing what they did, they could have killed all the elders of this land. And that is the problem. She has already done that. 
you could have killed all the elders. And that is why the elders have decided that to stop this kind of thing ever happening in this village, one, you have to give them four cock fowls. <laughs> 16 big jars of sweet pan wine. Two big rams, of which anybody who puts his fingers through their nostrils, it will all enter. Get the ball. 50 cola nuts. And then one. Big sack of rice. All these must be presented within the next two AK market days. Badabam. It's in this family. Every day is another story. Every day is another fight. So, so, wahala, balava. Chorus house, who will take the blame? The children are insane. Every day is another trauma in Mazi Chorus house. Every day is another story. Every day is another fight. So so wahala, balava in Mazi Chorus house. Who will take the blame? The children are insane. Every day is another trauma in Mazi Chorus house. What's all this problem? Father Rackings children They should be living in harmony What can be done to bring back peace in this family? Every day is another story Every day is another fight So so wahala Palava In Mazi Okora's house Who will take the blame? Children are insane. Every day is another trauma in Mazi Okora's house. Oh, my God. 
This is cold water, please. Drink it. It will make you feel better. Okay? This is the handwork of your children. I hope you know it. This is the handwork of your children. They think they can send me out of this house, eh? Hmm. Well, from now on, it's me and them. Enough is enough. They're staying in this house. There's no even pay for our school fees. Thank you. Can you look at it? You even buy for my hours. What are we going to do? Oh, okay, did you suggest it? Let's go inside. Let's go attack them. Let's go inside. Let's go. Let's go inside. Papa, you pay my school today. Today or never. What do you want? Papa, it's about my sister's school fees. You know it's long overdue now. Angie Baker, are you the mouthpiece of your sisters? If they need school fees, won't you let them come directly to me and tell me themselves? Papa, I am their eldest sister, so I am supposed to talk on their behalf. Njideka, I have no money now. All the money I had I spent in buying that far for your stepmother. So, if you don't mind, in a few months time, you could remind me about school fees. But Papa, by then they would have sent us away from school. And you know we are preparing for our work. <laughs> Okoyo? Yes, my dear. Hmm. I think I'm going to need some new handbags, some new shoes to match, to go with my new wrappers, don't you think? I think so, my dear. I think so. Papa, what are you saying? Are you saying what do you mean by what I am saying? I mean, what am I saying? About the school fees. That I have no money now. I have spent all the money that I have to buy my for your stepmother. So, like I said, wait for a few months. I'll probably be able to do that for you. Why don't you all stop disturbing your father? You, Njideka, stop disturbing him. Get married. You're old enough to get married. And even you, Ogechi. Okay, Erima, marry and train your sister, would you? Okay? He's not going to die because he has daughters. You can all marry and go to school from your husband's house. You that is talking. Why didn't you wait until you were married before going to school? Eh? Indeed, you have no right 
to challenge your stepmother. I will challenge her, Papa. I will challenge her if she opens this her dirty mouth again to talk rubbish in this house. Who is talking to you? Who do you think you're? Who are you talking to? Who do you think you're talking to? Nonsense. You think because all these small small boys are chasing you, you can talk to me anyhow and tell me I'm talking rubbish? Papa, are you not going to say anything? Rappers from Injide. Hey, Injide. Mama, I won't lie to you. Papa bought these rappers for Beatrice and refused to pay Erima, Ogechi, and the Jew school fees. So, so we planned uh, and we took the rappers so that we'll send them and raise money for, for their school fees and, uh, and money for the elders. God! God! So your father has become this bad, eh? Hey! Okoro, so you have become this bad. I can't believe this. Your father shamelessly threw me out of his house. And now he's spending money buying rappers, laces for Biati. Hey! What did I do to your father? He says Obumsel, our son, is a fool, an idiot. Did I give back to Obumsel alone? We did it together. And then he complains that I have only girls, girls, girls. Am oh my God! Eh? To decide what to give somebody. Hey! Jesus Christ, I cannot believe this. George. Mama, don't worry. Okay? Don't worry. We'll make sure that you come back to the house, whether Papa likes it or not. Hey! I cannot believe this. Look at all these rappers. Please. Jesus, I've been married to your father for how many years? He has never even got me one single lace. Eh? Now he's buying how many for this woman? You know what? I'm going to the market. I will sell these things, eh? But this one, I am keeping this one. Georgia, a woman and took us. I am taking this. How does it look? Mm -hmm. It does, eh? Mm -hmm. I will tie this one. No problem. You know what? We'll go inside now, eh? I will change. Then go to the market. You stay here and wait for me. Eat whatever you like. Mm -hmm. Wait for me. Let me go to the market. I'll bring the money now, but I'll sell them cheaply so that we can collect the money immediately, eh? Mm -hmm. Let's go inside. Hey, Okoro. Okoro. Hmm. Okoro, chicken. Nayago, we got this money for you to help us purchase the items the elders have found us. You, you know we are young girls, and we don't know if we go to the market to buy these items, if we we'll get the exact ones the elders would like. You know, like the rice, the cola nuts, and especially the palm wine. We don't want the elders to be angry with us again. So please, Nai, help us purchase these items, please, so that you can get the original ones. Please. I still wonder why you brought this money to me. The items. Your father would have been the most appropriate person to get the money. We know that, Nai. Nai, you know how it is with us in the house now. Our father's heart is no longer with us, but with his new wife, Beatrice. Please, Nai, help us, please. Nai, please help us. Nai, please. Nai, please. It's okay. It's okay. No problem. That's no problem. 
we all liked your mother for all the years she lived with us in this village that we sat back and watched your father sent her away was a matter of can't help she was a good woman yes she was all right bring the money bring the money how much do you have here 25,000 there, 25? Yes. For all the items? Yes. Huh? Nay, no, thank you. Okay, Chiu Chiu, a rima. Give me the shoe. Thank you. Nay, thank you. Uh huh. Nay, no, thank you very much. Oh, I'm happy to We should be on our way now. It's all right. It's all right. Uh, check on me later hmm? uh, for the items, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Every day is another trouble in Marcy and Connor's house. Every day is another story. Every day is another fight. So, so, Wahala, Balaba, in Marcy and Connor's house. Who will take the blame? The children are insane. Every day is another trouble in Marzi Okora's house. What's all this problem? Father Rocking's children. They should be living in harmony. What can be done to bring back peace in this family? Every day is another story. Every day is another fight. So, so, Wahala. Balaba in Marzi Okora's house Who would take the blame? The children are insane Every day is another trauma In Marzi Okora's house How are you talking? Hi What's your name? I'm Richard Right? <laughs> Why are you laughing? Mm. You're from this village? Yes. Ah, what a pretty girl you are. Where is your house? It's not far from here, just down there. Can I pay you a visit? Tell her like her sister. My, my brother is in love with you. With your sister. Just yeah, I want to see her. Come on, let me ask my sister. Tell me. What does he want? He asked me my name and where would he live. He said if he can come and see me at home. His friend said he likes you too. <laughs> so what did you tell him? Nothing. I just wanted to ask you first if they can come to our house. Well, um, okay. Tell them to come to the house. And he should come with his friend, the one that likes me. Sister, you know Papa won't like that. Don't worry, Ogich. I know what I'm doing. I'm not a foolish girl. Tell them to come to the house. Who's the car? What's that? Ralph, love you. Okay, shut up.
Papa, we don't know. Why don't you let everybody speak for herself? Are you their mouthpiece? It's time to check out already spoken for all of us. And I believe if it took the rapper, she would know. That is true. My dear. Papa, Stan Jideka has already told you that none of us did, and that's the truth. So, there's a thief in this house now from outside, or what? Huh? In short, Papa, we are not thieves in this house. But um, we took the rappers. We sold, we sold them so that we can be able to pay our fine and pay a rima ogechi and ujusku fees, which you refused to give us. These children sold my rappers. You sold my rappers. You're terrible children. Terrible. Ogechi, what did you just tell me? Mm -hmm. Mama, I said that Sister Jideka has already said no one of us did. And that's the truth. And now she, she's saying that we took the rappers. That's the new truth. Mm. Oh, there is truth. A new truth in my house. You see? They ganged up on me. Yes. They ganged up on me. And this one, Jideka, is their ringleader. Mm. So you had the wicked mind of your stepmother's rappers to go and sell them so that she can go naked. Eh? My dear, the best thing to do is to also sell their clothes. Yes. So that they will go naked. Yes. In fact, on Saturday, take their clothes to the market and auction them. Use the money to buy a new set of wrappers for yourself. Yes. Now listen to me today, and go because that is what you are. And you people start getting used to this clothes that you're wearing because you may have to wear them for a long time because of your wickedness. Yes. Unless you are sensible enough to go back to the person you sold those rappers to, retrieve them and refund the money. If not, for a very long time to come, he will be going anywhere you want to go in this dirty clothes you're wearing. Finish. Shut up! My boy. Yeah, young man. What kind of insult is this? Huh? Have you no respect at all? Huh? Whose children are you? Sir, we are we are from a Bukus compound. From Obaru's village. We yes. just came in to pay the, the village yes. a, a, a visit, sir. From where? From Lagos, sir. From Lagos? Yes, sir. Uh, so in Lagos, people have no respect for people. People just walk into people's compounds and start sleeping with their daughters. No, no, right? No, sir. No, no, we've not Very good. done that, sir. Okay. I'm going inside. By the time I come out, 
But finally, here, yeah, you have yourself to blame. You won't do anything. Man or woman? Man! Where is Nji Dega? Where? In my room? What's she doing in my room? Nji Dega! Nji Dega, who is this? Our carpenter likes acting as if he's our father. Meanwhile, our father is in Lagos. Me, Ndideka. Me. Ndideka. What are you doing with a man in your own father's bedroom? Huh? Take it easy, Papa. Take it easy. You just have what she said. She says you are the carpenter that does carpentry works for them. So go and do your work. Okay. Okay. Wait for me. Wait for me. You, in fact, all of you in this house, all of you are Papa. irresponsible. Papa, please drop that cutlass. Ah, what's the noise all about? All of you girls are useless. Wayward and not worthy of being called Okoro's daughters. None at all. None of you. Look at you. Oh. So, Papa, we are now useless girls. Yes, you are. Hey. Hey. Well, the reason is simple, Papa. We have no mother to guide us. Yes. Maybe we would have been good girls if our mother was not sent away. She would have been here to guide and direct us. So, Papa. If you want responsible daughters in your house, bring back our mother. Yes. Bring her back. I want to talk to you about those children's clothes that you seized. Please, I do not want you to auction them tomorrow. What? Don't even go there. I want to sell those clothes and I will. When they sold my wrappers, they didn't think twice, did they? Maria, I want you to realize that they are just kids. Coco? Yes. What's gotten into you? What's happened to you? It's as if you're taking the sides of your daughters. No, it is not so. It is just that uh, I don't think you should auction those clothes. You understand? Those children have been wearing the same clothes for two days now. Because I want you to understand that. Well, that's just too bad. Because I will sell the clothes and buy myself some new wrappers. Please, my dear. Eh? Please. End of story. <laughs> Go 
you're blaming me? Why don't you blame your ex-wife who stole my wrappers and then came to the market with them? Ah! So, if a mad woman strips herself naked in the marketplace and slaps you, you will also strip yourself naked and slap her back! Ah! Did I not warn you not to sell these clothes? Did I not? What has selling of clothes got to do with this fight? Good! If you did not go to the market to sell the clothes, you will not see lawyer. And if you didn't see lawyer, you will not fight in the marketplace. So, it's all my fault now. Yes. I'm the one you're blaming, eh? Yes. Oh, 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 You have changed. This was not how you were before. Natalie, tell me, what did you achieve? Say it! What did you achieve? By going to fight in the marketplace, what did you achieve? You see, you people do not listen. That is the problem. No, you never do this to me. No. Why she lived with me for 30 years? She never disobeyed me one day. Look at you. You are not in the house for many months. You are disobeying me. You are not listening to me. I give instructions. You can't tell them. Look at you. I, 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 I never believed that you could do this. You. You. In this, in this house, in this very house, look at you. How is your cousin? How is your cousin? <laughs> Nonsense. We shall see. See, Obum, she has not started crying. Mm -hmm. By the time we are through with her, she will cry blood. Mbeku, <laughs> tortoise. You will behave as if you don't know anything in this house. But everything, everything that is happening in this house, you are the cause. Look at. <laughs> Nonsense. Obum said. You should be ashamed of yourself. Yes. No wonder Papa calls you a fool. <laughs> a big fool for that matter. You don't even know whose side to be on. Eh? Ah, you know whose side to be on? A terrorist. You know whose side to be on, Osama Bin Laden. If you know whose side to be on, why don't you go and get married? So that you have somebody to be on your side. Nonsense. Oh, terrorists, go and bomb her. If you are annoyed with her, go and bomb her. People are laughing. Because she gave chicken the last time, I think she'll give you another one to support her school. Of course, supporting Anna, you must start planning how you guys support her. <laughs> Yo, what are you still doing in this house? Is it not your maid that are building houses everywhere in, in the city? What are you doing here? What do I need house for? Why do I have one here? What do I need house for? Huh? Am I not the first son? You people who will marry and go away. In short, if you don't marry, if you don't marry on time, I'll push you out. You don't know me. When I take over from father, I'll push you out. Okay, you people have gang up, Ali. You people have gang up against me. Don't worry. Big Stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. Eh? Wipe your tears, please. Stop crying now. If you continue crying, I will cry. You know they say much you don't cry. Stop 
Lord. Okay, let me help you cry, please. Let me help you cry. Let me help you cry. Miss Beatrice, I invited you to this office. And I invited you because of your recent conduct. As a teacher, you have a standard to maintain. But I'm disappointed. Why? Teaching profession has been a noble job. Of old, and people respect teachers. But these days, you teachers of other days, nowadays, I don't know what you are taking teaching to be. How dare you, a disciplinarian, someone that shows an example, how dare you fighting, not only fighting, but fighting in a public place, in a marketplace. I'm sorry, sir. I was pushed to the wall. Even if you were pushed to the wall, Miss Beatrice, ah, you would have concluded that your innermost temper. Well, the teachers of Anushi Primary School will sat, discussed on their conduct in recent times and concluded, and even recommended, that you are going on three weeks of suspension and to capital. Who does your temper? Your salary for next month is going to be half paid. Let me remind you once more. That is not the end of the road. The board of directors of Anusha Primary School, if they should hear about this your recent conduct, I won't guard the kind of discipline measure. They will give to you because you people are bringing the name of teachers in this school to the mall. A moment, Miss Beatrice. There is a rumor going around this school. And this rumor is within you, my teachers, that you, you are all persons whom I respect a lot, went to a lady's house, drove out this woman out of a woman ago. What then are you imparting to this student we are teaching? That is my private life. But let me tell you, whether personal life or not personal life, you are a public figure. As long as you are a teacher, and as you teach under me here, you must maintain that decorum, which is good example, so that these children we are teaching will emulate good things and good examples from you. Bye bye. Be good Goodbye. Why are you lying down here like this as if there is a problem? Look down me. I will listen. If Papa does not listen to you, I will listen. Look, I care about you in this household even more than my father. I really suffered a lot in this house. Don't worry, it will be alright now. Don't, don't, look, 
I love you. I, you don't understand.
she's our mother, and I believe if we talk to her, she'll get to her. Ah, okay, you go and talk to her. Yeah? Yes, Papa. Papa, we can even meet her beforehand and talk to her. I mean, even before you meet her. M me? To go there? What about her brother? They were all there, they were requested to this day. Hmm? Okay. If you will go first before me, I will I will go. I will go. I, I, I'm sorry. Please, okay. I'm sorry for what I did for you. You know, I'm sorry, see? There comes a time in a man's life when when you guys will not understand. Boom, boom. You are a man, you understand. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, uh, my dear girls, I'm sorry. Please. Hmm? Forgive me. Brother is very rich and he can take care of all of us. Living without you girls is like someone living without their hands. I'm only going to work It's not lonely. I, I want you to come here. Okoro has embarrassed and disgraced my family. And he didn't even carry his big body to come here and beg with you people. That's how wicked he can be. So that she can marry me again. That is why. 
me and my kinsmen are here. Mm. Can we come in? Something on me, I, I, I don't know. Please, please, please forgive me. And it's not fair. I know. I just want to ask you a question. Yes. What did I do to you? What did I do to you to deserve this kind of treatment? <laughs> but, but you see, this is the work of Satan. I don't know what came over me. I want you to understand, besides, we've come a long way, 30 years of marriage. Our children are grown up. When they're going to get married, we should be there. You understand, together. We are a bum himself. We get married someday. That boy is a man. You understand. See what he did? He chased her away with a cutlass. I was there. I didn't know what to do, please. Have you forgiven me? Hmm? Have you forgiven me? I don't know. You don't know? I don't know. Please, my dear. I'm sorry. It will never happen again. It's okay. Oh, my dear. I don't like you, so don't, I, don't do it next time. It will never happen. In the future, uh -uh, it shall never happen. That's your old Betty. Betty? Betty, who is Betty? Do you know who drove you? A boom sell my boom boom boom. Yes, my yes, boom boom. As a soldier, a man. Eh, yes. So now you know. Yes. <laughs> oh my dear. <laughs> <laughs> my heart is like gold. <laughs> 